Good morning. Sunday morning. Happy Sunday. Welcome to Education and welcome to another episode of You Laugh, You Lose. If you are new to this channel and new to this series, the game is simple. You laugh at anything, you lose, you do a punishment. What is today's punishment? It's twofold. Number one, you have to go and eat this thing. Find a Burger King that serves the $292 burger. I, I don't even know how many patties that is. A lot. You got to go eat that. That's what you, one sitting too. Two, you got to go wish Dave a happy birthday. It was his birthday last week. Head over to his channel, drop a comment, wish him happy birthday. That's all I got to do. If you're feeling extra generous, head over there and subscribe as well. Happy birthday, Dave. <laughs> Does that sound sincere as an older brother? <laughs> Happy birthday. If you're ready for today's video, head down and like this video. And if you are new here, please make sure you are subscribed and have the bell clicked for notifications when new videos are uploaded. Now on to today's game. If you laugh, you lose, go. And so it begins. Only the very best generations will get this. Good cartoon. Is it the best? No, absolutely not. You're so full of yourself, Gen X. You know, this is a Gen Z thing too. We watch these cartoons. No parking. No kid. What a great place for a sign. The only, you know what? Maybe it's there for the bikers. And those people, they do need to see that. The cyclists, as they call themselves. They probably do need to see this because you know how they are. <laughs> I, you know, I love all of you cyclists. Just relax. It's a joke. Okay. Some of you get really offended in the comments. It, relax. Scientists invent bracelet that gives electric shock every time a person curses. Me in traffic. <laughs> Great scene from Home Alone there. And it is weird. Like, there's a switch that gets flipped when you start driving. Like, there's a veil that gets between you and any empathy for any other person outside of your car. When you're on the road, I don't know what it is, but the curse words flow. True love is getting fat together. It's true love, man. Staying together till death do us part. And getting fat together. That's what it is, man. It's love. What do you have with no fat and no sugar? Uh, napkins. <laughs> Duh. <laughs> In all seriousness, everything has sugar today. If it says no fat, it probably has a lot of sugar. If it says zero sugar, it's a lie. It's got uh, what sucralose aspartame, whatever the fake sugar is, it's totally not good for you either. Found footage of me not locking in a mortgage at 2.6% in 2021. Yeah. Um, those times are long gone, I think, unfortunately. Maybe one day they'll come back, but it's probably going to be a while. Circle the smallest number. <laughs> Look, he had the right ones too, and he's like, yeah, I'm, gonna, I'm just going to I'm going to be a smart ass here. And I'm going to, you know, not even be a smart ass. I'm going to think outside the box. I'm going to actually be smart. That You marked him wrong? You're marking him wrong. Come on. That kid's got a high IQ. James Webb Telescope, 7,600 light years away. 44.6 gazillion quadrillion miles. White House security camera, 15 feet away. <laughs> I still have no idea whose coke that was. You know, because the cameras, they just don't, they're not that, they're kind of grainy. No one knows. Nobody knows. Minute car wash. Oh, really? Whoever owns this car wash, they hired all these birds to poop on you right after you get out of the car wash. So you have to go around again. Genius business move. If you ask me, kind of scummy. If you're trying to make that dollar, you don't want to Walter White it, Walter White it and launder his money. Poop on the cars. With birds, of course. Your disease is caused by your lifestyle. So, should I change my lifestyle? Not at all. Here's a pill. <laughs> you know, you gotta gotta make sure uh, Big Pharma, they're getting their cut. Don't change your lifestyle. Don't naturally try to change things in your life. Get on a pill. It's that easy. When you don't answer messages, but you're sharing memes. I condone this. I do. You know, we've been through the email thing. You know how many unread emails do you have? I, I've seen really crazy ones, like 100,000 unread emails. 
How many unread text messages do you have? That is next level. I think Dave's at like 400 or maybe it's 40 something. He's, he's really high. My answer whenever someone asks me how old I am, I was once on the telephone with Blockbuster Video. Yeah. That's really old because, you know, when you're a kid, you grew up in the 90s, you were never on the phone. It's always your parents. Oh, I'm not playing the late fee. Well, it's been late for three months. You have to. When you're over 35 and awake past 9 p.m., call me Nighthawk. <laughs> I'm just over 30, and yeah, when I'm up till 9, that's that's really late. I've said that many times. Literally no one. My uncle's profile picture. <laughs> I've never understood this. I don't get it. Like, what does this... How is this supporting Trump? Isn't this kind of like deifying, going a little bit overboard, you know? If you do that to any politician, that's a problem. Maybe you should turn off social media for a while. Tonight, the Orioles became the first pro team to wear uniforms with Braille lettering. Awesome. Hashtag bigger than baseball. The blind community is going to be so touched when they see this. Again, grow up. Apparently, this is from 2018. I can't believe they did this. Like, really, dude? If you're cold, they're cold. Put ice in the deep fryer. Do not, for the love of God, do that. Never seen it firsthand, but I've seen the videos. And this is how bad things happen. That's all I'm going to say. Don't do this. Whoever made this meme, shame on you. I am 99% sure I never drank water as a child. That is... I don't think I ever drink water either. It was Capri Suns. It had Sunny Delight. I saw a kid puke it up one time. Couldn't do it anymore on a tire swing. True story. Did you guys drink water as a kid? I don't, I, unless it was outside from the hose. Other than that, I mean, have kids, they said. Dude. And I know I've said this, but when you do have kids, if there's food, if you have food, like you take something out of the fridge, a, a leftover sandwich, or you want a piece of candy... All of a sudden, they hear the rapper and they come running. They need a bite. Like, their your food is their food in their head. So, just <laughs> haven't seen my kid do this yet, but I'm sure she will. Uh, that, that happens. It, it does. Gaming is my therapy. Me gaming. See, this is why gaming is not my therapy because I want to win, and I'm not good at it, and I don't win, and I get mad. That's just what happens. You know, it's part of it. Me after folding four T-shirts and a pair of jeans. Get your ass up. Complete the, the folding. Just do it. When, you, when you're done, you're done. You don't have to worry about it. It's done. And you don't get wrinkled clothes. Easier said than done. I understand. But just do it. Psychologist. Every dream has a meaning. My dreams. <laughs> That's a cat, right? Or is that a, that a bear? That's a cat. How they dress girls today. How they dressed me. <laughs> All right. I don't know how old that kid is. Probably four or five, maybe. Baby clothes, kid clothes are expensive. They grow really fast. They grow out of them fast. Dress them like they are on the right. Don't spend a lot of money. It's expensive. Cardi B makes music for girls that think talking louder is winning in arguments. Mmm. Mmm. I honestly feel embarrassed for those people that think that talking louder is winning the argument. They just look really stupid, but... And they're annoying. They're loud. They're just... That's a fact check true, though. When you're driving through your hometown and see an old friend from high school. <laughs> uh, I haven't, it hasn't been this extreme, but I've, you know, it's people you don't talk to for 10 plus years. And then you see them and then you're supposed to, like, share memories and say, hey, how you doing? Right in the middle of the supermarket and, like, uh, like, but neither of you really care that much. It's just kind of someone you used to know. Or just don't even acknowledge each other. How about that? Can we start that? Who has the best fries? Really? This is a tough one. I don't even know if I've eaten in all these places. Never been to Raisin Cane's, Jack in the Box. Never. Um, I've had the White Castle Frozen Burgers, but never at the store. Dairy Queen, it's still weird to me that there's actual food there and not just ice cream. Checkers? What the hell is Checkers? Churches, never been there. Taco Bell has fries? What? All right. It doesn't get much better than the Arby's curly fries. Come on. Everyone knows that. How rating systems were meant to work. 
bad, average, excellence. How I perceive rating systems, garbage, <laughs> adequate, and fake. If it's all five, yeah. It's, it's all about the quantity of reviews. Because you could have one review that says five. That, that means nothing. You could have five that is all five. That, that means nothing. It could just be five friends that went and reviewed the product. You need like, you need hundreds of reviews. My neighbor recently had some work done to his house. Definitely not going to use his contractor. What in the hell? What? I don't understand what's going on here. I hope that's fake. Are they trying to avoid those cords there? But then you got, you're going back up. Yeah, come on, man. Really? Can't believe there was actually a time in my life when I could solve this. What was the reason? <laughs> Guys, the reason is problem solving. Duh. Didn't you know that? There's not a, there's not no way, other way to teach problem solving than math. That's just what I'm told by all the school people. Who wants to be less depressed? Who wants to delete their Instagram? <laughs> Hey, if you delete Instagram, then you can't go watch the shorts we're posting over there on at real Tyler Zed, okay? Our favorite parts of Z education, you know, go follow us there. So, and that won't depress you, of course. How Morgan Wallen became a country singer. You know how good music is? Yeah. Let's make it not like that. Hey! You know what? I gotta defend him here. I like his music. I do. It's not bad. Some of it's a little hip hoppy, a little poppy. But he's got some good stuff. Doctors, don't worry. The x-ray won't harm you. Also doctors. Uh, kind of weird that there, there's so much protection that goes into it. You got to wear the vest. Uh, then they go behind a wall. Little concerning, just a little bit. 90s guy's first crush starter pack. Oh, hell yeah. Pink Ranger, man. All day. Pink Ranger. Ranger. Was that Topanga? She was all right. You know, but it was it was Pink Ranger. Realtor code words. Cozy, tiny, hidden gem. <laughs> Box. <laughs> Won't last. Will last. Motivated seller. Desperate. Up and coming. Ghetto. <laughs> Stunning. Completely normal. Feels like. Doesn't feel like. Good bones. About to collapse. Do we got any realtors out there? Is this true? Let us know. I know there's realtors that watch the show. Down in the comments, is this accurate? She got a big booty, so I call her Big Booty. Quote from Two Chains. Just a modern day Bob Dylan, Two Chains. Oh, that's so good. You're you're on, dude. Th those lyrics are just phenomenal. The evolution of trash. <laughs> is that app still up and running? I mean. It was literally like a two-day thing. Everyone got excited for two days, and now it's it's kind of dead. <laughs> Hi, welcome to Jackass. I'm Steve-O, and this is Bam. And today, we are going to eat spicy food and see who gets heartburn first. You know, I, I, honestly, I kind of wish that that was going to happen, but now Bam hates Steve-O too. He hates Johnny Knoxville and Jeff Tremaine. I don't know, dude. It's such a weird thing. I still like both of them. I would love for them to get back together. I just don't think it's going to happen. At least not anytime soon. Corn dogs are basically just meat Twinkies. Whoa, dude. That's like so true, dude. I have discovered at 43 that I don't even need to drink to feel hungover. I just need to stay up later than normal and dare to eat something after 10 p.m. <laughs> See, that's how I feel when I stay up late. Or if that cold front moves through with the low pressure, your joints start hurting. Just kidding. I haven't been there yet, but it's coming. Notice how every girl on BuzzFeed has a nose ring because no one will put one on their finger. <laughs> uh, didn't it go out of business? I wonder why. I think so, right? Didn't they just go bankrupt or something? Or they're laying people off to use AI to write articles? I don't even know. But that is, that's funny, man. Gabe T., Great joke. Also, not a joke. It's it's true. Kids these days will never understand. Swimmer Mix 1999. Those were the days, man. And you get to burn CDs. If you're Deeb, you're burning CDs and selling them at school and getting in trouble. True story. People always ask me which one is better. Bad, better. My brother in Christ, it's literally in the name. 
I watched both of them. I love both of them. Breaking Bad is definitely better. Better Call Saul is pretty damn good, though. Anamosa State Prison, 1899. Anamosa Middle School, 2012. That is depressing. We continue to have these, like the, the architecture of then versus now. It's really, really sad. Depressing. People still in crypto are like the kamikaze Japanese Imperial fighters you find still hanging out in the remote Pacific Islands, not realizing the war is over. <laughs> That's a true story. There's literally guys in the Philippines, I believe, uh, that stayed there for decades, still thinking that the war was going on. Um, now, you compare that to crypto. Not a bad comparison. That being said, you guys know I like a, I like Bitcoin. It's got some hope. All right. Let's recap on this one uh, about a year from now. Let's just say August of 2024. We'll, we'll recap this one. A small toddler is the closest thing you can have to a Pokemon. It follows you around. You love it dearly. No one else can understand what it's saying and is obedient only when it wants to be. The main difference is that training it to fight other toddlers is frowned upon. <laughs> now we just need to start naming our kids cool stuff like Pikachu and Charizard and, you know, Snorlax. You have to survive 20 minutes with one of them for $100 million. Which one are you picking? Ooh. Oh, dude, I don't know. Because I know all of them are fairly fast. I think you have to go Gator. You're not running, outrunning any of those other three. They're all fast. They all have jaws that could rip you in half. You got to go Gator. And, you, you know, you're not getting on the back of one of them and ride it out. You could do the Gator. Gator for sure. There's no question about that. I could do that. Works great. I can feel the cold air already. Oh, come on, boys. You got it in backwards. What the hell, man? Meteorologist. Dress for the high 90s. Me. <laughs> Dude, so How high, dude? Oh, dude. Liberal virtue signaling. Hate has no home here. Unless it's hate for Trump, his supporters, white men, Christians, and conservatives. <laughs> uh, you know, sadly, it's not funny. That is a fact check true. That's just, um, they are full of hate. Full of hate. I know people like this in my personal life. Very hateful people. The most hateful people I know. When I'm older, I just want enough money to have a covered porch so I can sit outside in a thunderstorm with my coffee and mumble, we needed this. <laughs> That's a dream, man. And, you know, you see the grandkids every once in a while. <laughs> Any part in words? Eh, I don't know. Just tired. <laughs> There's a Elsa meme of Dave, yeah. Accurate morning show if you don't Listen, this is what he says every morning. I left coffee in my car last night. Still want to come to Canada? You mean I don't even have to buy a fridge when I come? Uh, frozen coffee? Most of the year, yes, you don't. It's, uh, you know, if you're like Winnipeg and North, you got from, you know, oct early October to May. So, yeah, you get a free fridge. Pro tip. To drain all the oil, squeeze the car real good. You got you to go to a real good uh, mechanic for this one. Not all of them have this equipment. So make sure they squeeze it all out. You want to get all that bad juju out. We celebrated last night with a couple adult beverages. Metamucil and Ensure. <laughs> That's disgusting, but it, those technically are adult beverages, yes. Normal. Alt-right terrorists. Those alt-righters, man. Just disgusting. I can't believe how uh, just hate, just filled with hate. It's totally not normal. Eating food from Starbucks be like, wow, that 3D printed sandwich was so good. I don't know why this makes so much sense. It, it is processed, over processed food. You just throw it in the microwave pretty much. Yeah. And it's expensive, so expensive. So high, I thought this was New York City bunch of radiators it kind of looks like it a bunch of heaters warning low flying owls lost chihuahua oh really dude that's not even funny that's depressing and i don't know that can't be a real sign i've never seen a sign for owls that's crazy maybe 
point of view. You're a camera shooting a superhero movie. <laughs> One of the reasons I hate superhero movies. I do. I say it all the time on the morning show. I hate superhero movies. Hate it. There's not many I like. Brad Pitt and Boris Johnson are both 59 years of age. That is incredible. I guess the stress of being a sleazebag politician gets at you. A lot more than chain smoking. I'm pretty sure he chain smokes Brad Pitt. Reminder that Tarantino wrote a scene in Dusk Till Dawn where Selma Hayek pours tequila down her leg and forces a guy to drink it by sucking on her toes and then cast himself in that role. <laughs> Gotta weird. I do love his movies though. In which battle did Napoleon die? His last one? Where was the Declaration of Independence signed? At the bottom of the page? The Ravy River flows in which state? Liquid state? What is the main reason for divorce? Marriage. <laughs> Got an F, A plus for creativity. That's, again, shame on you, teacher. Shame on you. This guy is going to be an entrepreneur. He can think outside the box. No one. My teammate's Mike. Yeah. There's always one guy in the party. Every single time. That... <sighs> Move your microphone away from your face, man. Come on. You're not bad at responding. You just don't care. There we go. If you have a thousand plus unread text messages or any at all, you don't care. And that's fine. That's totally fine. At my funeral, I want a group of Italian guys to walk up to my coffin in black suits and say, I'm going to miss you, boss. So my family think I had something big going on. <laughs> not a bad idea. Morgan Wallen makes music for dudes who steal catalytic converters. <laughs> That's BS, dude. Who has it out for Morgan Wallen? Who hates this guy? I don't get it. The guy's on a giant heater. He's owning the music world. It's him and Taylor Swift at the same time. How to listen to the mainstream media. Yeah, double. Double hearing protection. Because those 3M ones, they don't, they don't fully protect you. We know that now. Put in the plug. Put the over ear. You're good to go. Ignore them. One has to go forever. Hmm. I'm going fried chicken. Going fried chicken. I have to. The other ones are just too good. The right woman makes life heaven. The wrong one makes it hell. Choose wisely. Ooh, that's that's a strong message there. Oh, Harry, look at you. You got your hand on her shoulder. You're so supportive. That poor bastard. Oh, my God. Thank you for giving me a personality. I'm literally just a disgusting beer. Yeah, oh, dude, like we go and we try IPAs. It's our freaking personalities and we don't want kids forever in our whole lives I don't know, that's that's what i think of when i think of ipas did you know texas is so large you can fit the united states the moon and another texas inside of it <laughs> fact check true i heard this on the radio when i lived down there you get a the facts about texas texas is a republic texas can is the only state that can fly its own flag as high as the united states flag the texas capital is actually higher than the united states capital it's all true, man. This one especially. And all the Texans out there, I know you guys You guys can handle jokes and humor, so I know you don't get offended at that. Even the ones that, uh, you know, sent their little triggered comments before. I know you guys are, you revoked that. Now you have a sense of humor. Thank you. <laughs> stop. You get, relax. Everyone, just stop. Get out of the comments. How'd you do in today's video? Did you laugh at all? If you did, you lose... And you got to go get the burger. And you got to go say happy birthday to Dave. And again, if you're feeling real nice, subscribe to his channel. Let me know how you did down in the comments. While you're down there, please like this video. Please help us get it recommended to others. That's it for today's video. Until next time, I'm Tyler Zed, and this is Education. For the children. Idiots.